the end of this first fall is Diana's death and how that is dealt with. So they're kind of self-contained, if you like. And it was an incredibly intense three or so hours mm. spent with a man considerably younger than me because halfway through I realised he was in mere nappies, darling, when <laughs> Diana died. Whereas for me, as a daughter of Diana with her Ladybird book onwards, yeah. this was the most seismic moment in my young adult life, I dare. Yeah, well, I remember it very, very clearly. I'm pretty much the same age that she would have been, I think a year or maybe a year younger than she would have been. And I mean, I remember, you know, waking up to it. It's an absolute devastation. I took my little girls straight to Kensington Palace with white flowers. Everyone was crying. I was working those days uh, on the big breakfast on the bed and we, we just took a desk and just put it in the road outside Buckingham Palace. And we just turned on the cameras live in the morning and just people just poured towards me, just wanting to yeah. say how devastated they were. I mean, it really was cataclysmic at the